we should we move on to mm -hmm. Martin's presentation? Is this working? Yeah. So uh, uh, yeah, I would um, try to um, start over with uh, with your uh, topic. Um, so first of all, I want to say something to this share thing uh, uh, too, because um, I know those share nodes in New York from the early beginning of this share movement, and uh, we also have uh, now, I think, three share shares in, in, in Germany, and there are a lot of, uh, uh, and maybe all over uh, uh, the world, 20, 20 or 21, just a second. And um, just again, something from share. So, so uh, uh, I want to say something. If uh, uh, if you compare it with a traditional jam session, I would say it is possible to uh, 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 to really uh, um, react instantly on those others. Um, the biggest difference, I, I would say, uh, what is going on is that uh, uh, in with the digital media, uh, you, you click on your laptop, on your software, and you uh, uh, don't produce one singular sound or one picture or something, but you permanently uh, uh, create a sort of class of pictures, so are uh, uh, by an algorithm. So it is uh, the potential of, uh, for many pictures or many sounds. And you make a decision which sound should be uh, 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 put on the screen or, or on the loudspeaker or, on, on, or, or which picture or video footage should be done on the uh, screen on, on the uh, wire video beam uh, and so brought into the session. But so you have a you have an aspect of decision making in uh, uh, in the uh, uh, work between each other in a gem session. That's not the same than if you. That's normally you don't have the, the aspect of decision making. But that's typical for these media stuff. In uh, uh, if you compare it with. Um, with the digital media stuff, if you compare it with more older media or uh, uh, other environments. Yesterday, Dominic told us something about um, uh, um, technology and uh, cultural techniques. And uh, that anything has even, uh, he said, even uh, sex, good sex, uh, 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 has something to do with, with cultural techniques. This was what he was saying, and I think even if you uh, you have also a cultural environment, yeah. So, and and if you have a, a, a cultural environment permanently around you, I would say these uh, uh, technological things help to enhance special uh, things in, uh, uh, for human beings. For example, the uh, um, Industrial Revolution. It was an enhancement of physical uh, sort of energy or I don't know uh, uh, how to say it. Uh, uh, media is maybe the enhancement of information and uh, uh, distribution of information. Digital media have the potential of uh, uh, creating uh, uh, classes of information, and uh, have uh, they are they can get changed and uh, uh, rearranged. So there you have this uh, 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 not just the um, cognitive element, but also the social element, the, the emotional aspects in it. So I would say if you talk about. Uh, 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 these uh, participatory media, we have uh, uh, to know that, that these uh, digital media have some special aspects in, in there. And, and this is when, uh, uh, why I would say, yes, of course, you have a, a, a really sort of t a, a jam session, and, uh, but, but of course, the, the, the aspects of how to create your stuff is not the same. And, um, 
just for to, to say another uh, something again about uh, 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 share before I go on with other stuff is um, okay 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 so here you have a list of actual uh, 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 shares uh, uh, you find on the net and uh, maybe in the future also we will have a sh there will be a share uh, uh, founded by the students of this department maybe uh, uh, a share in Ankara um, you should uh, feel welcome to the share community and um, okay I want to go further on to Uh, and, and show some examples of uh, uh, where we in my institute work on uh, in the field of participation and uh, with digital or via digital media. So uh, first I have to say beyond this share aspect uh, um, we work as an institute very often together with um, cultural institutions libraries, museums, and so on. And there we have the aspect of um, visitor participation, for example. So uh, um, some people may think that uh, in, in our times, people are, they use all this media stuff and don't go into the museum. But that's not true. Since the uh, uh, development of all the, the internet and these all these digital media things around us. People uh, use more media and also the museum is a sort of media and, and, and more people are in, in the museum today than, than 10 years before. So that's interesting, an interesting aspect. But what do they, uh, people want there? I think that uh, uh, something changed and um, today people, um, they they love to uh, this mixed style where they have some fun, uh, uh, maybe learning something. Yeah? So if you go out uh, uh, of this university, an academic institution, you may want to learn something in your uh, daily environment, but you, don't, uh, but you want to have it may, maybe more playfully. Maybe you want to have it in a social environment, so doing something together with other persons. So it's boring to, to just sit uh, behind the computer or behind your books permanently. Yeah? So uh, being active makes fun. And so where uh, uh, is the combination of learning, of having fun, of, of uh, 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 maybe uh, getting some new impressions? And I would say these, with these digital media, we have a, a lot of new cultural techniques um, uh, that um, can be used in the uh, social, intercultural, and uh, uh, formation of, of uh, 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 our environments. And oh. Oh, okay. So maybe now it's better. I hope so. So okay, we care there in this uh, uh, about these. Um, Museum, and I want to show. Okay, this is a little bit slowly here. This machine. Okay. Okay. I think I have a problem. Um, it doesn't show what it should show. Um, maybe, but it uh, takes time now. I, I opened this uh, PowerPoint from the beginning, so uh, maybe there is um, uh, maybe we can open it on your machine and I uh, go on with another example. This would be maybe better. Just a second, I'm sorry for this.
So I, I okay. Now it's there. It's uh, which one is it? Okay. okay. <coughs> Um, Hold it. No, no. no. There. This double, double click. And then this. I don't need some. No, no. Okay. Maybe uh, 27 or so. Yeah, that's it. Okay, thank you very much. So, um, oh, okay, now we are uh, uh, in a project that uh, um, works with several uh, uh, European museums and it is uh, uh, about visitors' participation in the museum. And there, of course there are different sorts of uh, uh, participation in the museum. First of all, you have the visitors, the persons who are in the museum, or the visitors, yes. But then, each muse most museums are in a city or in, uh, or in a village, and you have all the citizens around. And sometimes they don't have anything to do with, with the museum or the cultural institutions. But we have the, uh, uh, the thing that um, today, uh, more and more p people in Germany, for example, half of the people are, are over 50 years old. So they want to, and they stop uh, uh, in their, their working life when they are about 62 or so. So what should they do after? They, they want to be engaged in, in, in their uh, uh, environment. But uh, uh, in, in this moment, we have the situation that you have these experts, and they run the world. And maybe you need for, uh, 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 in, in just for, I'm talking about Germany, 80 million people, you maybe need 10 or 20 million people to run it, in a way. Maybe. To make money, it's better to, uh, if 30 million work in it, but to run it, you just need 15, uh, 15 million from 80 million. So what is with all these other persons? Are they not, uh, uh, can they get engaged somewhere else? And uh, uh, our idea is that people want to do something. They want to be engaged in their environment. They, don't, they want to do something for maybe their community or, or, or some cultural things, but they don't have the, uh, 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 there's no bridge between them and uh, uh, the experts. So we try to figure out how, for example, uh, can uh, people work, uh, uh, do something in, in the museum's work. I don't speak about interactive media, that people can press a button in a museum or somewhere else in the urban space, no, and, and something, a machine uh, uh, is starting a movie or anything else, no. It's not about this sort of interactivity, but it, it is about uh, um, how can people get part of their uh, um, institutional environment? And uh, of course, we have uh, um, different types of um, of uh, projects, and each pro uh, each museum in this uh, uh, EU project has its own style of. Uh, uh, and wishes how people maybe uh, uh, should or can um, participate uh, using uh, uh, inter uh, uh, digital media. So one aspect is the uh, aspect of collaboration and sharing things uh, is also interesting on the expert level for the museum. So what we install is that each museum has a so-called interactive corner. It's a platform that can be used by the experts, but also by the visitors. So if someone is creating some content, making photos or other stuff, which has to do with the museum's work, they can get uh, um, shared between the museums. So you have uh, uh, in this, uh, 10 European museums in the moment, and, and they share their stuff. And now visitors can um, um, work for example, on just I, I give you some examples. What what I mean by uh, uh, participating in the museum's work, you have the aspect of oral history. So people uh, um, 
in, in, we have in, in uh, Bulgaria, uh, we have the situation that there is a lot of the local history is not written down. So because they, uh, uh, it was a, a something yes, something no, it, depend, it was very, there was a strong ideology behind. So, uh, and now uh, the school uh, pupils, they, they, for example, can ask their grandparents, how was it in this time? We, we, it's not about uh, 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 any aspects of history. We are here focused on, on the in industrial uh, 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 revolution and, and things uh, coming out of it, like uh, uh, the textile industry all over Europe. And uh, of course, the, the, some, in some regions, even the parents worked in this field. Yeah? So they, they run around, ask them, they record their stuff, they make photos on, on, on places on a region, and they bring it into the museum. There, together with the experts, some um, exhibitions uh, 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 are to be developed, and they are exchanged between the different uh, uh, museum places or museums. So that's one aspect, for example. So this is uh, combined very often with the aspect of local uh, archaeology. People run around at places of origin and uh, uh, map it on this interactive corner. So they, they make photos, they, they have this geomapping geo -mapping stuff. Uh, um, they use their own mobile phones or, or stuff like this uh, for it. So um, you have something that, you, that they care about, their real environment, and they put things into this, in, uh, 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 in, onto this information level, the internet level, for example. Then um, something else is that uh, at some places um, we have this uh, 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 the construction, uh, people work on, 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 on uh, narrative productions in different forms. So even this is, uh, uh, you, of course, they will uh, they first need to learn how to use the tools for it. But then if they uh, uh, can, they do it in the museum at, in this project, and, and then they can do it on their own and will also um, bring it into the museum's work. So we, all, we also have stuff like... Uh, it is more interactive stuff. For example, um, movies and the museums about... Um, in one museum it is uh, uh, the, stri the strike of the workers in the 1920s. So there was a problem about uh, their salary and they make a big strike. If you now go, through, uh, uh, go around the street with the strike wars, you can see in the... Um, uh, in the windows of the old uh, fabric building, some screens, and they show the people at the place of origin walking on there. And you, have, you will be recorded by some camcorders and, and uh, um, automatically brought into the video footage. So you see you in, inside of this uh, uh, old movie with the people doing their strike and things like this. So we, we are also talking about how can you... Um, uh, get closer to this historical thing by using visual media and using aspects of uh, um, uh, maybe um, of emotional aspects to identify yourself more with, with uh, the aspects of history. So this is also, an, uh, uh, I think, an interesting uh, uh, point. And here are some different forms of um, uh, of participation we have in this project listed. And, um, and I want to go further on to another example, which is not part of this project, but of another one. And uh, please, therefore, I would again need uh, the, uh, the change to the other machine. Okay, it, it takes a second. And um, this other project is, is uh, another style of participatory project. <laughs> it is about uh, um, how to um, work on different aspects of, of actual uh, um, communication styles or, or, or cultural techniques in communication. So we have in, in urban uh, space, we have 
uh, a lot of individuals running around with these mobile phones and, and just doing their own stuff and, and no one uh, is looking, uh, uh, is maybe is not in communication with this, the people who are at the physical same space. And uh, uh, so you have an enhancement. You can maybe, you fall with someone on the other end of the world, but, but uh, 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 you don't care about the people around you. But the, if you see in the uh, world championships or, or other sport events, you see all these people uh, on, on public, in public space, in these uh, uh, public viewing areas or urban screens. And uh, you know, there are a lot of urban screens used for, for, uh, uh, by media artists and, and for art stuff too. And so we, we told ourselves how could, uh, can we combine this, these aspects, so this, this indi very individual communication aspect which is uh, the, the, the mobile phone would be the, or the iPhone would be the best symbol for it. And uh, on the one side, and then uh, doing real stuff in, in real uh, uh, public space. And um, therefore we created our uh, software. Stärke Stories, coole Movies. Mach scharfe Bilder. Schreib wilde Geschichten, zeig was du drauf hast. Du bist nicht allein. Join now. So this is our internet platform and we went into the public space. Like you can see it here. And um, with some other technical environment. Here we have a, with a cube. Uh, and uh, uh, with a uh, uh, projection on each side. And uh, so people come around and uh, they ask, oh, what, do you, what are you doing over there? And we say, okay, do you want to, uh, 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 to have fun? Okay, join our storytelling game. And, and uh, you uh, uh, don't need to, uh, to do a lot of, you just need to have a, a mobile phone with a, with a, uh, a camera in it, and uh, uh, that's all. And so people send us an SMS, and uh, they can, uh, could write a, a short story via SMS and, and send it to, to the server. And, um, and this short story, story is divided into keywords. And uh, we created, the machine is creating, the software is creating virtual teams. And each team is getting uh, some keywords out of the story. And then you get a, a message via SMS and it is on the word, maybe the word is dog or something. You don't know the context. You don't know the story uh, uh, completely. But uh, um, then he, uh, it is said, okay, now you have three minutes or five minutes time to make a photo on it. And people run around in the city to uh, uh, make photos that uh, um, are some, in some way uh, symbolize uh, uh, the, the term. And, uh, and then they send the photo back to, this, uh, to the machine, to a number, a phone number, and via MMS. And uh, so the machine is created, uh, creating a sort of uh, a short clip, and automatically it is done together to a clip, with, uh, uh, and, a, and a sound is automatically created. So to give you an example of how it looks like, um, And later on, the participants can vote on like a normal community platform vote, which was the best story, which was the best video clip, and, or, or, and, and, and so on. And uh, uh, so maybe uh, finally... Um so I don't know what it is. So. So that's it, and you see it instantly at, uh, uh, at the place where you stay. So you have maybe three minutes to, uh, to run around and everything else is going instantly.
So people ra uh, uh, are staying around and they ask, oh, who is, uh, uh, you've been in this team and this and, and oh, th this was your club. Okay, now we, we get into a competition between the teams and make better footers and so on, things like this. And you see here, okay, it is just in German, but you see here, this was the SMS with the short story, very s short one. And, uh, uh, and of course, the photos, it, it, is, it is just a fun, it is a crazy. They, I don't know if they really match to the, to, uh, uh, to, uh, to the story. But, but in a way, it is funny because it has some, uh, uh, there are associations. And, and it is a little bit uh, uh, just a game for to, um, to uh, uh, combine, finally, in a participatory way, this thing in real urban places and from the digital media. Okay, I think I'm over the time, so thank you very much. Thank you, Martin. Uh, do we have any uh, questions or comments for Martin? <laughs>